Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KG4 Ray, and welcome back to Supermarket Simulator. So I have run quite a few days. I've been watching a lot of videos, just playing, you know, the game, getting stuff done. Um, we are stocked. We've got stuff out here. We've got more stuff over here. This place, I couldn't fit any more. I mean, a couple things here and there. But for the most part, this place is completely packed. And I'm looking to make some money. Now, I, you guys will already know if I got the store expansion. I'm... I might get it at the end of today and maybe do the revamp tomorrow. That's kind of what I'm thinking. We'll see. Depends on how long it's going to take me to make the money. All right. Everything is looking good in here. Let's go take a once over the store just to kind of take it all in. I worked hard in this store. I like to go around and look at it sometimes. Makes me very, very happy. This game has a very completionist aspect to it. A very almost like collectible like thing going on where you just kind of stock everything. I, I don't even know. I can't explain it i can only give you an idea of the feeling i have when i play this game and it's this completionist and just organization thing going for it it reminds me a little bit of when i used to collect comic books uh i collected comic books and i love the idea of there being like a 300 issue run of uncanny x-men and i'm like collecting it and okay i have episodes you know 200 to, through 220 and then i have like this or whatever and like i actually made when i was younger and i didn't have anything else to do uh, because back then, um, I don't know if I had the internet at, at the point, but I was bored one day and I took a, sp a spreadsheet and I just put down X-Men, Uncanny X-Men 1 to Uncanny X-Men like through 300. I think it was about 325 when I did this. That's where the run was. And I would just put, you know, an X if I had it and no X if I didn't. And I, I had a good time with that. And that's very much kind of what this is. Like I've got X's all over the place because everything's all stocked. There's a couple missing X's right there. Um, but yeah, that's kind of the idea. And um, I stopped collecting uh, X-Men. I stopped collecting comic books altogether because the, the artistry got really bad. Um, it, I don't know where the artistry came from, but it went, like I was going to get back into comics like one time at one point, like maybe a couple of years after I stopped uh, collecting them. And the artistry looked very... I don't even know how to say it. It just looked like unfinished, like lazy. It looked unfinished and lazy. Like, people were just kind of, like, kind of drawing a picture, but not. it didn't look like they were trying. It's really hard to explain how I felt about the comics at this point. And I don't know what year this was, but it was after, uh, you know, Uncanny X-Men was awesome. Um, all the way up to the 300s, I really liked it. Uh, I remember one of the last things I looked at in Uncanny X-Men was Juggernaut. Er, no, not Juggernaut. I'm sorry, not Juggernaut. Um, Onslaught. Onslaught. Not a great story, but at least, the, at least they were still drawing the, the comics well. But, yeah, after that, eh, just kind of got out of it. Um, as a matter of fact, when I moved here, my uh, my friend used to drive me to the train station all the time when um, Autumn and I had thick flights out, and I really appreciated that. Uh, and he was driving me to the train station on my last day, you know, in New Jersey, um, and I gave him my comic book collection. There's only a cu couple boxes. I had, like, a bunch of Spawn. Like, I think I had Spawn issues 1 through 10 in there. I had the first appearance of Gambit, a um, couple other ones in there that were, you know, pretty cool. But, uh, yeah, I was just like, here, you know what? Hey, take it, man. Thank you. Thank you for everything. He was He's a really good friend. The guy won the lottery and uh, bought me a new computer when he did. I, re I really appreciate that. Never forget that. So, pretty good here, man. Take my comics. You can sell them, sell them, whatever. I, I don't care. They're yours. Thank you for, you know, everything. So. It was a perfect time to move out to Missouri, though, because, like, you know, um, I never hung out with anyone I hang out from high school. I see people like I, I used to hang out from high school on Facebook, and we are completely different people. Like, I can't believe I ever, like, had anything in common with them. I mean, they seem like good people. Like, you know, they were good people back then. And they're probably good people now, but just nothing in common with them. Um, and it's it's really strange. And they didn't change. I changed. You know, uh, back when we were, like, 18, we would just get a bunch of beers and drink and play guitar and just kind of hang out, whatever. Um, now, I play video games. I don't drink at all. I don't, like, you know, do any of that stuff anymore. I, I would like to find time to play guitar again, but it's really hard when you're doing YouTube. Uh, but yeah, like just completely, completely different people. And, um, you know, I remember seeing on a Vsauce video once. If you guys don't watch Vsauce, you really should. It's great. Great. Uh, Michael is awesome. Like great YouTube thing. And I was watching Vsauce and uh, they said that like every, like I think five years or so, every atom in your body dies and gets replaced with another one or every cell. So even the atoms, down to the atoms. Like I think he said... After five years, you are a completely different physical person. Every single item in your body has been replaced, which is crazy. 
And I think mentally too, I think we're all different people. Like I think every like 10 years, I just completely change. And I feel like I've been getting better, uh, hopefully. <laughs> um, some things I have not been getting better with, like my diet. But I think other than that, I think I've improved as I got, I've gotten older uh, mentally, socially, all that good stuff. And, um, I, you know, I, I look at my friends on Facebook. I'm like, I remember when I used to hang out with them in 1995. And I'm like, they're totally different people. They're not even the same person. They're not. The only thing they have that makes them the same people and me the same person is memories. That's it. We're completely different people. I don't think anybody's the same person 10 years later, honestly. So, um, yeah. Uh, I think there's something else I wanted to talk about. I don't remember. Oh, yeah, guitar. So I want to start playing guitar again. But I, I can't. I just don't have the time because anytime I'm like, if I'm, if I was like to sit down and play guitar, you know what I'd be thinking the whole time? I could be grinding in supermarket simulator and you might be thinking, okay, it's just pretty, it's pretty crazy, right? Like you might be obsessed. It's not really being obsessed. It's more of, I'm trying, I put 110% into every video I make and, and, and if I could put a little bit more into it, I will. Um, people are getting away with some bullshit today, by the way, I'm just too busy talking to you to ban them. But, uh, yeah, if I could, like, put another hour, you know, into a video, I will. Because it's going to make it a better video. Period. You know? So, for me to sit there and play guitar, and I'm like, I should really be grinding in the forest. You know, I got to build that I gotta build that rock wall. And, you know, I got to make some money here because I got expansions I got to buy. Yeah. I don't know. I did do something different uh, the past couple of nights. Well, actually, I guess I started last night. Um, I started playing MLB The Show. Now, I know what you're thinking, Cage. Why don't you play guitar instead of MLB The Show? The gu guitar is a lot more of a of an investment, of a commitment. So uh, the show is something I could just kind of lay, lay back and chill with. So, yeah, I started playing MLB The Show. I got on the Switch. It kind of looks like ass. I'm not going to lie. Um, but if I was going to get it on the PlayStation, I'd have to buy a $500 PlayStation. Um, so I'm going to play it on the Switch for now. We'll see where that goes. But trying to tell my wife I got to buy a $500 PlayStation for one freaking game. Like, that's just, that's just irresponsible. I'm not saying I won't do it, but it's irresponsible. Have a go, man. Plus, if I save that $500, I can get another arcade one-up machine, so. But, and it, like, my, my wife's like, I thought you said graphics don't matter. It's very true. I'm a big a believer in graphics not mattering. But, here's the thing. It's not that the graphics look ugly, and I don't like them because they look ugly. The graphics look ugly. Hold on a sec. Excuse me, can you smile, please? Chick -chick. One, two, three, you're out. That's the guy that reminds me of the uh, Russell, the, the the referees in wrestling. Yeah, you're banned, bro. Get the hell out of my store. Don't ever come back here again. Freaking punk ass piece of crap. <sighs> so anyway, yeah, MLB the show is freaking awesome. I suck at it, but it's awesome. And um, oh, I started watching. Please, guys, please. Uh, Pig Hammer's watching. If you leave any spoilers, you will be banned. So please, please do not leave any spoilers. Or you, maybe not be banned. You'll be timed out. I don't know. But just do me a favor. Let's be good here. No spoilers. I have watched the first three episodes of the new Fallout TV show. And so far, I am loving it. And that's all I'm going to say. Fallout TV show, it's on, it's on Amazon Prime. Uh, one thing I love about it uh, that doesn't have anything to do with the show itself is they put out the entire season, which is what, the way it should be. Like... I'm going to go on a little rant here. Like, wh why are people still putting out episode to episode on any TV show? Do not make me wait. Don't make me wait. Because, like, at some point, I'm going to I'm gonna wait until the whole season comes out. And then I might be over it by then. You know? So, making me wait is not doing you any favors. Uh, like, this this week-to-week -week stuff. And I always end up liking shows less when they're week-to-week. -week. Every single time. I'm not really sure why. What's up, Dapper Dan? I'm not really sure why, but, like, if I have to wait, I think because if something bothers me, it, I, like, stew in it. Like, if, if something goes wrong, like, you know, an episode of Rings of Power is a complete S show, and, like, someone survived the pyroclastic flow, and I just, like, that's the dumbest thing I've ever seen in my life. If I could watch the next episode right away, I would get over it a lot easier. Although not with Rings of Power, because that was an abomination. But, like, if it's, like, kind of, like, a show that has problems, I'll get over them. If I could watch the next episode right away. Um, I kind of I kind of had that problem with um, The Last of Us. There's a couple episodes I didn't love. And they were like bottle episodes. It's like, come on, dude. Like, what was The Last of Us? Eight episodes? Or was it ten? I don't know. It wasn't a lot of episodes. We don't need bottle episodes. 
bottle episodes were for like, you know, when TV shows had 24, you know, episodes a season. You doing eight, ten episodes a season? You need a bottle episode? Come on. Come on. It was just... Although I guess those bottle episodes did affect the um, the overall story. So it's not like they were completely devoid of the story. So I mean, that's not a fair criticism. But I just, I just do not like it when I have to wait. I just... It just makes it it makes a, a worse experience. And if, hey, that's what you're going for, worse experience, and okay. But <laughs> you know, uh, what? Oh, do I have any red toilet paper? Hold on. Pretty sure I do. Pretty, oh no, I don't. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, I do. It's just not in there. All right. I will stock these myself. Thank you very much. I thought those were full. My bad. So we got some right there. We'll bring the rest inside. Red goes right here. Right here. Right here. And right there. Cool. And then green goes up there. We only need two green. Green. And green. And then right there is purple. 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 Oh, right, purple. And then right down there is paper towels. Oh, I'm not going to be streaming Saturday. This this video is going up Saturday. I usually stream Saturday. I'm not going to be streaming this Saturday. Just so you guys know, I'm going out uh, for like the day with um, family because it's my wife's birthday. And I will be streaming Sunday. It will be Supermarket Simulator. And then I'll be streaming again on Wednesday. And I think next, the weekend after, uh, we're also doing something with the family. I don't know if it's a Saturday or a Sunday. So the week after, I'll only be streaming one day as well. And then like... The family stuff's got to stop because, <laughs> like, I can't just be taking streams off. This is my job, you know? Um, I can take some time off, but not, like, two weekends in a row is asking a lot. But they're for my wife's birthday, so I will I will make time. But, it's you know, maybe, you know what? How about this? I'm taking off Saturday. How about I stream Sunday and Monday? I don't see any reason I can't do that. All right, so I'll be off tomorrow or today for you guys because it's going up on Saturday. I'll stream Sunday and Monday and Wednesday, and then I'll make up for that Saturday on Sunday. Or I'll make up for the Saturday on, on Monday, and I'll do the same thing next week, too. It's not as good as a weekend, but it's better than not streaming at all. Okay, yeah, that should work. That'll be cool. Hurry up, man. Hurry up. Come on. Go faster. Go faster. Oh, my goodness. Hurry up, bro. For real. Okay, good enough. Get out of my store. Um, two and nine. All right. I'm not charging enough, by the way. That product's found too expensive. It's too low. And book, beer, beef, potato. You know what? Let's just run another day. Let's just run another day. Another day. Uh, what do we got here? So we need red. We need green. We need purple. All right. Let's get some purple toilet paper. Paper. Nope. That's not how you spell paper. There we go. And we just do 10. Anything else? Oh, yeah, cleaning products. I'm going to get five of each. Even though I don't have room for them. It's okay. Okay. Uh, put this. Yep, so that's all good right there. I could just put this right here. Get away. This is where I stock my toilet paper. Hey, what's up, Dapper Dan? Looking good, bro. I used to think of staying alive. I gotta play staying alive when Dapper Dan's walking down the street. Unless I get want, don't want to get hit with copyright. In which case I won't. But just sing it to yourself. Or, you know what? When uh, Dapper Dan's walking down the street, why don't you uh, bring up staying alive on another YouTube tab or something? It will enhance your viewing experience. I can almost guarantee it. These back here. Is my register open? I have a feeling it's not. Nope, didn't think so. Uh, what? Put that right there. I gotta grab one of these. Make sure we don't run out of stuff while I'm bringing up 50 customers. Because I am the, the cashier god. How's it going, bud? Didn't I ban him? I don't know. Thought I did. Whatever. Alright, let's put this back here. Gotta be late. Let's see what time it is, guys. Let's see what time it is. 12.40. I still have to edit. 
make thumbnails, just freaking 50 different things, but that's okay. And I got to get up early tomorrow. They were like, hey, you want to meet at IHOP at like noon? I was like, <laughs> no. <laughs> freaking noon? You early birds? Get out of here. Um, I usually get up till like, well, actually I've been getting up around 12 recently, but sometimes I sleep till 1 depending on what time I go to bed. But I'm like, no, how about 1? Because I kind of felt bad too because they're like, we're taking the girls to soccer practice and then they'll be done at 11. Everyone's going to be hungry. And I was like, oh, I feel bad, but there's no way I'm going to be there at noon. Well, I would have, but I would have been there at noon if they, if they asked me to. But I figured, eh, I'll just throw it out there. Maybe maybe 1 o'clock will be okay. 9. They're coming over and we are going to play Cover Your Assets. It's a card game uh, between me and my wife, her brother... And her brother's wife. Uh, we, we played it. We went on vacation. I don't know. A year or two ago. And um, it was awesome. And one thing we did was we, we played Cover Your Assets for the first time. It's a card game. And it's awesome. Like seriously. You guys should give it a shot. Like if you have family around and stuff. Uh, I think you'll really, really enjoy it. Have a good one, man. I need to order my freaking basketball hoop. I want to order a basketball hoop. But man, it's going to be a pain in the butt to like get set up. Like for real. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to get tools I don't have. I'm going to have to get sand. I don't know where to get sand. I don't know how to work with sand. I don't know anything about sand. I guess it's not that complicated, but... Yeah, I'm just going to I'm gonna have to do that. But I want to do it. I want to get out there and play some basketball. I used to love playing basketball as a kid. Now, right now, I'm too heavy. But I could still, like, get out there, walk around, throw the ball around. And it would be... A, it would be... It would be exercise I would really not mind doing. Like, honestly. Maybe I can get a batting cage in my... How much do you think a batting cage would cost to install at my place? <laughs> How cool would that be, though? Imagine if I had a batting cage. I wonder if you can actually do that. I mean, all it is is a giant net and then, like, um, a pitching machine. And, like, I mean, shouldn't be that expensive, right? I'll have to look into that. I don't have a big house, though, so probably wouldn't have any room for it. But not that it goes inside, but <laughs> I mean, like, outside. We need bleach. Come on with this. Freaking stuff. Where's the other stuff? There it is. Alright. The toilet paper is not looking good. Okay. Well, it's still stocked out here, so I won't worry too much about it right now. Because I got to ring people up. Uh, 250. Have it going. And, uh, yes, I don't know why I'm grabbing this when I'm supposed to do toilet paper, but... That's where we find ourselves. Okay. 8.25. Have a good day. All right, what do I need first? Well, the people red. Is red? I don't have any red. And I didn't order any red. Ah, fudge me. Right, I gotta order red before we're done here. Paper 10. Okay. Get up there. Freaking ring people up. What's going on, man? Uh, 8.75. Have a good day. How are you doing? Oh, whiskey. Love it. How's it going? Someone could buy, like, a very small amount of things. I'm thinking, ugh, this jackass is going to walk out of here with only paying $23. And then they buy whiskey. I'm like, yeah, boy. All right, that's only $11. Now, normally I would run my mouth off, but that's Psycho Sid. So, uh, see you later, Psycho Sid. Um, 54, 75. Have a nice day. All right, you know what? Got to take care of that toilet paper. Go. Looking good. I don't think we're going to make it to the... um. Actually, I know we're not going to make it to the... What do I need? Like $90,000? So normally, normally, the way this would go is I would say I need $90,000 for the Section 8, 18. I need $90,000 for Section 18. So let's just go for it. I think we can do it. Let the store run out. And then I barely make it to $90,000. And I have an empty store. And then I spend six hours... Stocking the store. I'm not doing that this time. Not doing it. I'm gonna stay up with what I got going on here, and that's that's that. Okay, 
red toilet paper. And what's on the bottom? That's um, that's this one. The paper towels. Two. Three. Four. All right, looking good. Is there room for this? Not yet. Not yet. We're getting there. Hey, man, you phasing through stuff? Why can't I phase through stuff? All right, you know what? I should probably help them stock, huh? Uh, how about the, um... Oh, we don't have any of the bleach. I think I got some bleach out here. I thought I did. Yep, right here. Still not a lot. You know what? I'm just gonna order 10 of that. The hell with it. Bleach. 10. I find the game so hard to play when it's laggy. Not only because it's like laggy and like physically it's kind of hard to play, uh, but mentally, like when things are laggy like this, I kind of, I have a hard time like concentrating, I guess. We are ready to rock and roll again. I'm down to $36,000, but I am looking good. I've got a bunch. I keep buying this bleach by mistake. <laughs> I keep thinking I'm out of it and forgetting it's out here. So that's why I have like uh, nine boxes out here. We got some books. We got some french fries. Um, we got some whiskey. I should probably put this whiskey in there. And yeah, this place is um, like I'm really packing this place to the gills at this point. I think, um, <laughs> I think my last store expansion when I was in debt, I, I owed money to the bank. I owed money for my bills. I didn't have any money. I had barely any product. I think that did something to my brain. And now I'm just like stuffing the store with product. Just product bursting at the seams. I gotta have some of this glug, 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 glug. I wonder, as a non-alcoholic drinker, I don't drink. And when I did drink, it was mostly beer or stuff like that. Or like, I would have like, um, high C and Everclear, uh, which is really strong stuff, by the way. You gotta be careful with that. Um, never drank whiskey, never drank wine. I wonder which one I would like more. I did drink wine in, in, um, in church. We had the communion, but I don't think that's like the wine that normal, like that people drink for, you know, pleasure. I think it's just like some kind of, you know, church wine or something. Um, so I'm, I wonder, I wonder, I'll tell you that wine in church was awful. Absolutely awful. Um, I worked at a church, uh, when I was younger, it was my first job. And I would work there every Saturday, setting up chairs, putting out pamphlets, getting ready for mass because Saturday night mass and everything. And I remember me and my friend went back and like got into the wine where we were working. And we, we drank some of it. Like, and I was like, oh, God, like <laughs> that is horrendous. I think that was God punishing me, probably. And well deserved. Well deserved. All right. What's going on, buddy? All right, 7125. Have a good day. Register 5 is open. Register 5 is open, people. Okay. Let's see if anyone's interested in coming on Register 5. Can I bring in any of this cereal? Nope. Honestly, I don't have nothing to stock, man. Like, my stockers didn't even have anything to do. I think we could run a couple days here without even worrying about it. $90,000. Can I get it next episode? You know, I'm going to be honest with you guys. If I am going to stick by keeping stuff stocked, there's a chance I might not get it next episode. But I will try my best. I expect to be at least 50000 by the end of this episode. Well, no, not, not 50000 Probably almost 50000 So that puts me within striking distance. We'll just have to see. I don't know. Ooh, shoot. I just shortchanged her. All right, whatever. This is theft. Hey! Oh, that's awesome. I'm going to try and shortchange them more. All right. I'm going to try. And, yeah, I'm going to really shortchange people. Uh, how about... Yep, can't do that. <laughs> 97.25. Have it going, bro. Expert. I'm going to shortchange everybody today. I'm just going to be a jerk. All right. Can I add a little bit more? Oh, come on. He wouldn't even know. All right, get out of here. I can't... Oh, I'm not going to shortchange Psycho Sid, that's for sure. So how much can you shortchange somebody? Probably not that much, I'd imagine. Come on, nobody wants to give me cash now. 
<laughs> they know I'm. T they know I'm up to no good. Ah, uh, see, he's gonna give me cash. I'm not shortchanging this maniac. Not happening. I guess if they give me exact change, I can't shortchange him. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. Tomorrow's Saturday. Tomorrow I'll be going out to IHOP. Then I'll be coming back and be playing uh, games and stuff with my family. Ugh, damn it. And, um, actually, I guess I could just not give many change, right? Let's see. And 140.75. Have a nice day. Damn, they're all giving me exact change using credit cards now. They're on to me. They're on to my scam. It's funny, too, because like, what's the most I could possibly rob from these people? Oh, Psycho Sid. Old Psycho Sid. Alright, how we going, man? Give me some cash. Alright. Insufficient change, okay. Wait, so how much can you short change him by? Okay, cool. 50 cents. Awesome. It's not really much of anything. E uh, 81.75. I'm going to continue robbing people this whole day. The hell with them. The hell with them. What's going on, bro? Oh, this lag is making me so mad that I have to rob people. Excuse me, could you smile for a second? Okay, okay, hold on, hold on, here we go. Oh, sorry, you blinked. One more, one more. All right, your picture's going on the wall. You're banned. Get the hell out of my store. You only buy one item for two seventy-five. dollars You know, ugh. get out of my store right now. You're banned. Don't ever come back here. Leave this. Leave that lady. Have it going. Give me some cash, stupid people. Have a good one. <laughs> Worst store ever. <laughs> oh, let me turn off my timer. We're going long here. All right, how you doing, bud? The credit card, unbelievable. Have a nice day. Go to give me some change, lady. Damn, a lot of potatoes. Ugh. Oh well, at least she's, at least they're spending some money. Hmm. There we go. Short of nine dollars, I think. Right? I'm gonna have to start paying attention to it. Ninety-six, fifty. Have a good day. I have a good one. Now, am I going to shortchange Stone Cold Steve Austin? I don't know, man. That's playing with fire. Austin, wait, no. Cage316 says I just shortchanged you. And that's the bottom line, because KG48 says so. Nobody wants to pay with cash. And the word's out. 138. You know, it's funny, like, even me not giving people the proper changes give me, like, a few cents or a dollar. It's definitely not worth pissing people off, but I don't think there's any... I don't think there's anything to it. Like, I don't think it I don't think it affects the game at all. I think it will later, but just right now, I don't think it affects the game at all. I could be wrong about that. And... Aha! Stupid guy. Give me money. Only cash, guys. Uh, sorry. Credit card machine's down. I should be able to lie and be like, the credit card machine's down. I need cash. Although, if they did that to me at the store, I'd be screwed because I don't carry cash. 79.50. Have a go and Hold on, man. Hold on there, Jack. I gotta sit up. You better give me some freaking cash, bro. Unbelievable. I wonder if me shortchanging them does make me... I don't normally get this many credit cards. There we go. 65, hold on. <laughs> I'm just spamming the... I'm spamming left mouse and spacebar. 
Alright, so we're up to 45, 50. Damn, I got five bucks off him almost, right? I didn't look exactly. It was a lot. Even that's not really a lot. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha! You guys suck. You all suck. Just leave me. Listen, guys, let me. Hold on. I want to make an announcement. I want you all to leave your wallets at the door and get the hell out of my store. All right, looks like nobody else is getting robbed today. I'll get you next time. How's it going? All right, let's see what we got over here. How's everything doing? Uh, probably need some potatoes. Yeah, pasta's doing okay. I don't know, man. The, the stalkers seem like they're kind of they kind of keep it up a little bit. Kind of impressed. Let's get orange books. Oh my goodness, we barely have any orange books. Where did all our orange books go? Did we have a sale on orange books that I didn't know about? Wow, okay. Did he take more or... I don't think he did. Getting there first, bro. Ha, ah, too slow. Oh, he's got... Okay. He had pink books. Uh, do we need any of this stuff? Let's see if you need any orange juice. Eh, kinda. Kinda, but not really. We fit any of this in the back? Nope. Not by a damn sight. Where'd I get this from? <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Alright, whatever. It's going right there. Alright, let's see what else we need. Usually I stock the books. I'm not really sure why, I just like stocking the books. And they usually really need to be stocked, too. If I could find the right ones, that'd be great. Hey, stop stocking the books, bro. I got this. You go stock other things. I call books! Alright, we're gonna need the books right here. And we're almost done with the day. $50,000, guys. And I, I mean, I'm gonna have to order some stuff, but it's not gonna be a lot. I mean, I think we're going to go in tomorrow's episode with like $45,000 easily. And that's if I don't grind between then, which I probably will. Yeah, this is pretty dope. Cool. Let's see how we did. Oh, it only says I short changed one person. How's that possible? <laughs> how's, that, how's that even possible? All right. I don't know. Maybe I'm missing something. All right. I'm going to go ahead. Cheese, honey, and dog food. Let's just do that right now. Honey... Let's go with twelve fifty. Honey, dog food. We only have one kind of dog food. I'm gonna leave that. And cheese. We need to find what kind of cheese it was. I said mozzarella or something, but I only know the cheese by the colors, not what they're called. All right, mozzarella is blue. So blue cheese is mozzarella. <laughs> That's confusing. You know what? I'm going to leave where it is. All right, guys. I'm going to call this one here. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.